V, your college captain for wellbeing. Hi everyone, Simon here, the wellbeing campus captain for St. John's. Hey guys, I'm Jessica, your CTK wellbeing captain. Hi, it's Stephanie, your college faith captain. It's Justin Swarden, your St. John's faith captain. Hi, my name is Adele and I'm the CTK faith captain. I'm a Mongumbo, your curriculum captain. Hey guys, it's Shashank. Hi, it's Mika, your 2021 curriculum campus captain. Hey, I'm Lachlan, your 2021 community college captain. My name is Matias, and I am the community campus captain. Hey guys, I'm Mel, your CGK community captain. And we are your captains for 2021. Well, we are well and truly into lockdown number... I've lost count. What was it again? Lockdown number six, Steph. <laughs> what a crazy few months it's been. I'm sure many of us are anxious and tired of going into remote learning after having such a strong start to a seemingly normal year. But despite the lockdown, we've seen the amazing things that you've still been able to accomplish from home. Whether that be finishing your subject selections, joining and contributing in your team's course, or even just checking with your LM. You should all give yourselves a massive pat on the back. We know it can be hard to stay positive all the time and that lockdown is very challenging. If you're struggling, that's all okay. We encourage everyone to reach out, be it to your learner mentor, your subject teachers, your house coordinators, as they are always one message away and are willing to give a helping hand. Connect with your peers and friends. Although we aren't physically together, your peers and friends are by your side and ready to support you. And last but definitely not least, reach out to your family. Although they might not be able to help you write a whole comparative essay or solve a complex math problem, they are there and willing to support you and cheer you on every single step of the way. And once you've made sure to check in on your own health and well-being, please check in on your friends around you too. A little how are you can make someone's whole entire day. Another quick reminder to stand up and take a step back from your screen. So remember to take a break. Whether that's going on a walk, playing with a pet or grabbing a bite to eat, make sure to take some time out for yourself. I miss the crazy buzz of school and the news around us. I've got to admit, it can be pretty overwhelming. So what have you guys been up to to keep yourselves grounded? During this lockdown, I've been keeping myself busy with school work, also focusing on myself. Schoolwork has been a ton, especially because it's sort of mid term, but by giving myself breaks and asking for help, I think I'm managing pretty well. I'm also focusing on myself by doing the things I love and enjoy, which is um, music or sports, hanging out with family. So taking this opportunity and my time, um, it's been a pleasure. I understand that it's a difficult time right now as we're in our sixth lockdown, but rather than thinking of the negatives, let's think of the positives and yeah. Hi everyone! So we're back in lockdown. That sucks. <laughs> but I just wanted to say if anyone's feeling tired or unmotivated right now, just know it's really common. If you are feeling like that, talk to your teachers if you feel like you've fallen behind. They can help you, they can sort things out. Do the things you love. For me, it would be uh, reading or like listening to music. Do what you love and you will feel back on track. I promise you should all be really proud of yourselves for getting through the six lockdown. <laughs> stay organized, stay healthy, and most importantly, stay happy. Today, I'm gonna give you some quick tips for lockdown. I'm gonna do it really fast. Okay, ready? Play video games. Do a puzzle. Read a book. This is Moby Dick. Read a different book. Read two books at the same time. If you know, uh, an instrument, practice, and if you don't know an instrument and you have one in your house, learn to play. May as well, you know, listen to music. This is one's optionary, but if you have a pet, if you have a pet, spend time with them. That's all. See you all soon. Hi everyone, I hope you're doing well. We're in lockdown again, so I just wanted to say, take time to look after yourself, spend time with your family, check in on your friends, it's hard for them as well, and stay positive, we'll be back together soon. Just have high hopes. What about you guys, B, Steph? Well, funny that you asked now, because I'm currently sitting outside trying to soak up the last bit of sunshine for today. I feel like the winter doom and gloom is going away, so for lockdown, I've been trying to spend a lot more time outside, um, trying to go on my walks and trying to soak up as much sunshine as possible. Some things that I've been doing this lockdown that I recommend is revisiting some of my old favorite movies and books, as well as taking up some new hobbies, such as meditative coloring or sketch work. That's awesome that you guys are trying new things in lockdown and have a range of strategies to cope. Boys, how about you? Any advice? I want everyone to make sure to take care of their health and well-being because nothing is more important than ourselves during this sort of time. Make sure you catch up with friends online or just catch up on other hobbies because when you're at home in a room by yourself, 
They got to wear it only. Make sure you keep on thinking positive and stay optimistic for the future, and we'll all get back on our feet real soon. I'm looking forward to seeing everyone soon. Hope you're all doing well and staying healthy. I know how difficult it is to manage mentally with being glued to a screen all day and not socialising with your peers. It is critical that you take care after your emotional and physical health right now. Take a stop and consider if you're lacking inspiration to keep going. I'd like you all to support your future selves and hold on. I know you guys have the strength to do so no matter what comes your way. Please contact me or any of the other captains if you feel the need to chat to someone about being a more positive version of yourself. Hey boys and girls and everything in between. Seems as if we're in a very similar situation again and I really hope you're all doing well and taking the best care of yourselves. Going for walks, taking breaks from your screens and taking time for yourselves. Let's all try and get through this together and hit turn 3 running again. Stay safe everyone, can't wait to see you all again. You've all done such an amazing job and you've all shown great resilience. Keep up to date with all your work given out. Make sure you give yourself breaks as well to do stuff you enjoy like play a sport. Yeah, text friends, or even spend time with family. Stay safe and I hope to see you all soon. We really hope that in two weeks things might start to subside a little so that we can get back into the classroom ready to learn, ready to smash out the rest of term three. We've got this Caroline Chisholm. Stay safe, hang in there and... See you soon.